Hi friends. I miss you all very much. And I hope you guys are being safe and well at home with mommies and daddies and nannies. And maybe even grandmas and grandpas. Today I wanted to read you a book. One of our favorite books in the classroom. And it's called Everywhere Babies. By Susan Myers and illustrated by Marla Frazee. Frazee. I know you guys remember this book. This is the book that Olive brings to me every morning to read to her. And then all her other friends comes and joins. Every day, everywhere, babies are born. There are fat babies, or I like to say chunky babies, thin babies, small babies, tall babies, winter and spring babies, summer and fall babies. Every day, everywhere, babies are kissed on their cheeks, on their ears, on their fingers, their nose, on the top of their forehead, on their tummy, and their toes. Do you know where your toes are? Can you show mommy and daddy where your toes are and where your ears are and your nose and your cheek and your forehead? Everywhere, babies are dressed in diapers and t-shirts and bunnings and sleepers and play suits and dresses and sweaters and creepers. What do you guys have on? Do you have on your regular clothes that you wear to school? Like a t-shirt or some jeans or some jeggings? Do you have on your shoes? Are you in your pajamas? Your sleepers? Every day... Everywhere, babies are fed by bottle, by breast, with cups and with spoons, with milk and then cereal and carrots and prunes. I know a friend who really likes prunes and carrots, and that's Eva. Hi, Eva. How are you doing? Who drinks from a bottle? Does baby Macklin drink from a bottle? He does. Does baby Anna drink from a bottle? She does. Macklin and baby Anna are both breastfed by their mamas. What do you drink from? Olive and Noah, Peter, Alexander and Edward. You drink from a, a cup or a sippy cup. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you eat from your bowls and your spoon? Does Eva eat from a bowl and a spoon? And so does Macklin. Every day, everywhere, babies are rocked in cradles and chairs at nap time and night by friends and relations who cuddle them tight. Do you get rocked at home? I know at school, some of my friends get rocked to help them to go to sleep. And then some of our friends sleep on cots and they get padded to sleep. Or some of our friends Lay down next to teachers so they can go to sleep. Every day, everywhere, babies are carried in backpacks and front packs and slings and in strollers and car seats and bike seats, bike seats and on daddy's shoulders. Who sits on daddy's shoulders? Who gets carried in car seats? Baby Anna and baby Macklin get carried in when they come to school in car seats. And sometimes Peter and Noah I see in strollers coming into the center. Every day, everywhere, babies make noise. They cry and they squeal. They giggle, they coo, they bang and they splash. They clap their hands too. Can my friends show me how to clap? Say clap, clap, clap. Every day, everywhere, babies like toys. Rattles and tops and books that won't tear. Old pots and pans and a fuzzy brown bear. Books that won't tear. Olive has this really cool book that doesn't tear at all. 
Olive, where's your book about the your baby friends at the beach? Every day, everywhere, babies play games. Peekaboo and pat a cake. This little piggy. Roll the ball. Ride a horse. Jiggity, jiggity. What are you playing at home? Are you playing with your favorite, your balls and your blocks? Peter, are you playing with any dinosaurs or cars? And Noah, where's your dinos? Olive, I know you're reading somewhere. And baby Macklin and Anna are working on their tummy time and crawling. And Eva, are you walking yet? Alexander, what are you playing with? Are you playing with cars and blocks? Edward, how about you? Are you blowing bubbles with Mommy and Daddy and Samuel? Every day, everywhere, babies make friends with a puppy, a kitten, a goldfish, a bunny, with young people, old people, anyone funny. Have you seen any of your friends around town? Or do you have a puppy at home or a dog or a kitten or a cat? Peter has a cat. Maybe not a real cat, but his little kitty that he brings into school that everyone loves. What else are you playing with? Are you playing with your friends? Do you have any friends in your neighborhood that you're playing with? Or how about your siblings? Like Samuel is Edward's sibling and Penny is Peter's sibling. Who else has siblings? Oh, Eva and Sophia, they're siblings. And um, Anna, she has two siblings. Macklin, he has a, slip, a sibling too. His brother. Are you playing with them at home? Every day, everywhere, babies are crawling. Forward and backward on bottoms and knees, upstairs and downstairs, wherever they please. That's Eva and Macklin. Macklin, are you crawling yet? I know you were rolling when I last time I saw you. Eva, and you were standing all by yourself. Are you walking? How about my other friends? Are you climbing? Are you going to the park with mommies and daddies and grandpas and grandmas? What are you doing? Every day, everywhere, babies are walking. One step, another, they fall down and then pick themselves up and try it again. Abigail, is that you yet? Every day, everywhere, babies are growing. They can run, they can jump, they can slide, they can swing. They can dig, they can climb, they can talk, they can sing. That's all my friends. I have friends who can run. I have friends who can jump and slide and swing and like to dig in the dirt. They love the sandbox and to climb on everything that they think they can climb on, even when they're not supposed to. And they love to talk and babble. And they love to sing. Every day, everywhere, babies, babies are loved for trying so hard, for traveling so far, for being so wonderful, just as they are. That's you guys, my friends, my duckling friends. You are just as you are. And we love each and every one of you just as you are. Well, I'm going to say bye now. I hope to see you soon in our virtual classroom next week. Have a wonderful day. Mwah. Love you.